Hello, Randy Maines here. Uh, my blog this uh, this month is um, touting a specific uh, visual limiting device for IFR flying um, that I thought I'd like to pass along to you if you're interested. Now I've got no financial interest in this whatsoever uh, but um, as a instructor in the level D flight simulator evaluating um, airline transport pilots <clears throat> from 20, uh, 20 nationalities, about 160 pilots, um, in the sim there's a way to, um, to slowly bring the visibility down to see how they react to uh, uh, impending uh, IIMC event where they inadvertently go into the clouds. Of course, what we we can't really simulate that in the um, in the aircraft, can we? Uh, because our limiting devices are either the, the standard hood or the foggles, which are like these safety glasses that have a little window etched out of them, so you can see the instruments. But you can also uh, peek. And of course, one peak in instrument flying is worth a thousand cross checks. But uh, this fellow named Eric uh, Sebastian emailed me on LinkedIn to see if uh, I would be interested in this new product that he put out, um, invented by his friend Nick. Uh, it's a vision limiting device by Icarus. Um, that's the, uh, the name of the company. And you can look that up on YouTube. And, uh, and see what the vision limiting devices uh, is like in a demonstration. What I really like about the um, device is that it's not like the foggles or the hood where you have to put it on and, and um, then the instructor flies for you while you put this thing on and you go on instruments. Same with the foggles. This is a vision limiting device. It's clear plastic that comes around um, sort of wraps around your face. And what I like about it is um, it can simulate instrument, uh, entering instrument conditions uh, by an app that the um, instructor can use on his phone to, to slowly bring the vision uh, down kind of like what it looks like when you're entering um, misty or foggy conditions or go into a cloud. Um, like I say, I've got no, no dog in the race here, uh, but as an instructor, I can see the, the value in it. Uh, and um, so anyway, that's what my blog is about this month. And um, so read a little bit more about it. I've included two links, one to a YouTube link and one to the company link, so you can check it out. And uh, those of you uh, instrument instructors out there who might be interested in something like this, uh, it looks to me, I, I've never used one, I've never held one in my hand, but looking at the um, description about it and the, the pictures of it on the YouTube and the company website, it looks like something that you might want to consider. Um, so anyway, I hope you liked the blog this month, and uh, we'll talk to you later.